this little cosmos is super easy to make, so stay tuned and I'll show you how. To make our flower, we're going to begin with our green DK yarn and our 4mm hook. Now I'm going to do a slip knot onto my hook and I'm going to chain two, and this is in replacement of a magic loop. Now into the second chain from hook, I'm going to do nine single crochets. So that's one, and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Then I'm going to do a slip stitch into the first stitch of this round to join. And now we can fasten off. It's now time to introduce our second colour which is this light yellow yarn and I'm going to do the standard start colour change method. So slip knot onto hook, insert hook into the stitch where you want the colour change to be, yarn over and pull through yarn over and pull through both loops on your hook so you've done a single crochet. Now chain three, that's one, two and three. We're going to do a slip stitch into the next stitch. Now I'm going to chain three again, one, two and three and do a slip stitch into the next stitch and I'm going to repeat that all the way around on the nine stitches beneath. Chain three, one, two, three and slip stitch into the next stitch. So I'm now at the slip stitch of my last chain three, which will be in the same stitch as, the, as where we added the colour and then I can chain one and fasten off. And there is our second row for our flower. Now it's time to introduce our third colour which is pink and I'm going to do the basic colour change method to pull the yarn through any of the chain three loops and tie a knot to secure. And to begin with this yarn I'm going to insert my hook and pull up a loop and then chain one. Now the pattern repeat will be into the chain three space we're going to do one single crochet one double crochet, one treble crochet, another double crochet and a single crochet and we'll do that again in our next chain three space. One single crochet, one double crochet, one treble crochet, another double and a single. And we're going to do the same pattern in each of the chain three spaces beneath. So I'm now up to my ninth and final petal and I'm going to repeat the same pattern as before. Single crochet, double crochet, treble crochet, it wouldn't be me if I didn't drop a stitch somewhere, <laughs> treble crochet, double crochet and single crochet. Then I'm going to slip stitch into the first stitch of this round to join and then I can fasten off. And there you have your completed cosmos. Now all you have to do is weave in them dreaded tails and your beautiful flower is ready to use as you want. So don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. If you make any of these creations, tag me on Instagram and hashtag teeny crochets. And other than that, I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye now.